The family of a man severely beaten at Underground Atlanta is calling for unity. His family told Caitlin Ross he was attacked long after vandals smashed windows and broke into a business downtown. Craig Waters manages properties at Underground Atlanta, and his wife says he went to go check on the damage after everything had died down Friday night. She says he was taking pictures of the damage when seven people approached him. She says he warned them to walk on the sidewalk because there was glass on the ground and he didn't want them to get hurt. She says that's when they turned on him. The woman started pushing my husband, Craig, and um, a man jumped out from behind her and said, uh, don't mess with my sister. And then all seven of them began beating him until he passed out. And I guess at that point, they either got tired of it or thought he was dead. She says he has fractures in his face and every day more bruises show up. She says right now Craig is in too much pain to talk. She says police are reviewing surveillance footage of the attack and she hopes there will be an arrest. But she still can't understand why her husband was targeted. Craig doesn't have a racist bone in his body. We have two beautiful black son-in-laws. We have beautiful mixed grandchildren. He didn't deserve this. She says she's hopeful his injuries will be covered by workers' compensation and he'll be able to get back to work after he heals.